what's up guys Vasal I'm here today and in this tutorial I'm gonna teach you guys how to do the wiggle or screen shake tutorial it's very simple uh, first I'll show you what it looks like and this is like the emphasized one like I would never make it wiggle this much but I just did it so you guys could kinda see what it is and it, it looks really like shaky kinda I'm just pre-rendering it see it, it it looks really sick you know when it's not going crazy like that but I'm just gonna teach you guys how to do it it's very simple All right. and then after I teach you guys how to do it, I'll tell you give, give you some recommendations alright so first thing you want to do is go over to the side here where it says effects and presets you just wanna type in wiggle and you don't have to download anything it comes with all systems I think you uh, find this one that call, that's called Wiggle Position. You just drag it onto your composition. And here you go, you have Wiggle Speed. It's basically, um, Wiggle Speed is how fast it moves. Like it, like at one it might go kind of like this, and then at five it'll go like this. And, and then Wiggle Amount is like how much around it goes. Like it'll, if you have it on something like 50, it's gonna just like go crazy like go all the way around the screen and see how it stretches out more at a higher wiggle amount kinda like that and uh, what I would recommend so see it's a very simple tutorial I mean very simple effect but what I would recommend is to add this effect whenever you twixter or something so let's uh, throw on some twixter onto here All right. Let's Twixter this, because Twixter is awesome. Uh, we know how to Twixter. Let's throw it at one. All right, so we uh, we slowed it down. Now, uh, when you do this too, you also have to make sure that Twixter is above wiggle position in the, the effects thing. Otherwise, it'll just be really bad. And what I like to do most of the time, if I'm just doing something like this, I usually set the wiggle speed to about two. The wiggle amount to about seven and make sure um when you wiggle you're gonna have to stretch it out because you always have like these lines on the side so you want to have to stretch it out just a small amount a smidge and uh let me show you guys what it looks like see i didn't stretch it out enough you can see these gray lines here um but this is a really nice effect i love this effect i use it a ton it's it's clean it makes twixters not as jumpy kinda not as uh, unsmooth or smooth and uh, I don't know just nicer to watch overall um, so that's basically that's pretty much it um, so I guess I'll uh, just show the pre-render see right now my uh, frame rate isn't right because my computer's being really slow but see how it's kinda like shaking a little bit it's usually nicer you know if you if you try it out you'll see it's much nicer when it's the frame rate is correct but uh that's basically it for this tutorial hope you guys have enjoyed really simple tutorial a great effect I use it very often and um, yeah tell me what you guys think recommend some uh, more tutorials for me and I'll see you guys later